In this use case, I'll be going over a group audit. What a group audit entails is someone wants to see who is a member of either an Okta group or an Active Directory group. To do so, it's fairly easy. First, we'll navigate the dashboard and go to Auto Audits. We'll select Group Audits here, and we'll go to Create a New Audit. From here, we'll simply select an API source, then we'll name the audit. Let's run an audit for Domain Admins. So we'll name it as such, and select a due date. On this next page, this is where we're actually going to search for the groups that we want to pull. So I mentioned domain admins. Let's do this right here. And if you'd like, you can enter in multiple groups. You can see right here, this is an Okta group. If this was an Active Directory group, it would show up as such. I'm just gonna select the one for this example. Remember, you can always select a random percent of users. I'm gonna leave that blank to pull everyone and all users selected, not just active users. From here, I'll click done. Now once I've clicked done, it's pulled all the user information right here and it's put it in a nice report. And so from this point, we can go through each one of these users and quickly certify. You can even see the individual roles, types, profile, user manager, job title, and so on of each user. You can also go through and individually revoke if you'd like. Now, what this is doing, not just yet, but what it will be doing is revoking this user from that group entirely. So, I'll go back to certify this one. Let's revoke John Doe, though. One last thing here. As you know, we do have the delegate feature. From here, you can delegate using just email addresses. You can assign this to groups just by typing what Okta or Active Directory group you want to assign it to. You can even check this box so everyone in the group has to have the same action when they're attesting. And if there's a conflict, someone says certify, another person says revoke, you will be notified of that conflict and the report can't be finalized until that's resolved. Finally, we do have the auto delegate feature right here. All this will do, it'll pull the user manager right there and automatically assign it to be reviewed. It looks like everyone's been attested for. We have certified these four users and revoked this one user right here. So going back out, all we're going to do right here, we're going to hit this settings icon and this is going to execute this campaign. Right there, we are executing the campaign, and so what that means is that one John user, we will be removing them from that group entirely. This is taking place inside of Okta. Going back over here, you can see this user is revoked. We even have the option to download reports. Let's pull it up and take a look. So you can see right here, we had this was completed, the action was revoked, and you can see myself, the admin, was the person to take this action on this given date. All the other users were certified, and it shows as such. Thank you so much for watching this short video on group audits. Hope you enjoyed it. Please feel free to reach out with any questions.